Hey everyone, and welcome back to the Screeny. Magicians have wowed audiences for hundreds of years using their incredible illusions and sleight of hand to leave people speechless and desperate to understand what had happened. With the dawn of TV talent shows, it's only natural that magicians would be welcomed contestants. In today's video, we'll look at Got Talent magic tricks that will blow your mind. Before we begin, make sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel for more amazing videos about your favorite movies and TV shows. Number 9. Bondini How far do you think a magician would go to cement a place on a TV talent show? Well, one magician decided he would strap his father onto a rocket-rotated Catherine wheel while he threw a knife at him to catch a signed card. Oh, and did I mention, the thrower was bouncing on a hoverboard. Though this sounds like a pretty extreme trick to launch a career, it was in fact all part of the act for the father and son duo. Unfortunately, the risk didn't pay off as the clip was never aired on television. The clip, however, was uploaded to the Britain's Got Talent YouTube channel. Number 8. Dan Road This next clip comes from Britain's Got Talent and showcased a magician called Dan Rhodes who appeared to find his props around the back of a Walmart's recycling dumpster. After he confidently asked Judge Amanda Holden to hop inside of the cardboard box, we soon see that there is more than meets the eye. Oh, this is my magic wand! Amanda, are you ready? <laughs> The 15-year-old Manchester-born magician proceeds to cut through the center of the box until he has relieved Amanda of her bottom half, even separating them at an inhuman angle. When asked to wriggle her leg, she does so, which adds to the head-scratching feat Dan had managed to pull off. It wasn't the first time Dan had baffled people on TV, showcasing his deceptive skills on both Little Big Shots USA with Steve Harvey and Little Big Shots UK with Don French. Number 7. Tom London Tom London is a magician who has taken old-fashioned tricks and principles and brought them into the 21st century. Tom started his journey at 15 when he hacked his way into the school's computer network and uncovered students who were downloading illegal material. Since then, he worked on his hacking and coding techniques which evolved into mind-blowing tricks that use modern technology. Judges, in front of you, you'll see famous landmarks from all over the world. I'd like you to pick one. And when you've done that, write it down on a piece of paper in front of you. Don't let me see it. In this clip from season 12 of America's Got Talent, you can see why. Not only does he guess one of the judges' ideal travel locations, presenting them with a boarding pass, but also guesses all the other judges' locations by showing them multiple selfie-style videos filmed at the attractions they would have chosen. Where do you have gone? Uh, obviously Big Ben. Hey Simon, it's Tom here. Only thing you happen to pick, Big Ben, because I happen to be standing outside Big Ben right now. Number 6. Jamie Raven A clip from Britain's Got Talents in 2015 showed Jamie Raven competing in the semi-final delivering his final trick of the competition. He starts his performance out by making cards appear from an empty box. An empty box. For now. Watch carefully. Something. Which in itself is impressive, but Jamie then goes on to present the judges with items that were written on the cards that they had chosen at random. What words are you thinking of, please? Goldfish. Goldfish. May I have a glass of water, please? Oh my. The flustered magician manages to conjure a glass of goldfish, an ice cube, a shoe, and most impressive of them all, a life-sized helicopter that seemed to appear out of nowhere. The performance landed Jamie a place in the finals, but sadly he lost the win to the sausage-stealing Doug Matisse and her trainer Jules O'Dwyer. Jamie now works as a consultant, helping magicians with new material and coaching them on what to do on live television, such as not calling the beautiful Alicia Dixon sir. Alicia, I have a gift for you. I am so, so sorry for calling you sir on national television. <laughs> Number 5. Henry Richardson 
15-year-old Henry Richardson started getting interested in magic after watching some of the phenomenal magicians that had performed on America's Got Talent previously. The Brooklyn-born magician manages to not only swap a signed card from Melby's hand into his own. Maybe I can get my card to travel to your hand and yours to mine. Oh my gosh! Amazing! But also seemingly reads the mind of Simon Cowell, sending a paper doodle of a soccer ball into the center of the card he had transferred to Mel B. And Simon, what image were you thinking of? A soccer ball. I want you to tear that in half. Tear it in half, seriously. Because you're gonna find in between the layers of cardstock. Oh my gosh! Henry was eliminated from the 12th season of the show in the round before the quarterfinals. He performed a trick that saw model Heidi Klum sign a card, after which he pulled the exact same card from an unopened Pop-Tart pack hat. Unfortunately, the trick wasn't strong enough to get him through to the next round. Number 4. Special Head In a more bizarre entry taken from America's Got Talents in 2013, a man who calls himself Special Head manages to not only levitate above a pyramid, but also teleports out of the studio in a flash of smoke. I don't know what just happened. <laughs> oh! Whoa! <laughs> Special Head is outside on the marquee! Special Head grew in popularity further after America's Got Talent video went viral on YouTube, clocking up an incredible 44 million views. <laughs> Though he initially came across as unstable and slightly annoying, he impressed the judges and even got Judge Howard Stern to take back his premature acts. I'm going to take my ex back because I actually like what you did. I've never done that before. Number 3. Magus Utopia In one of the terrifying magnificent magic tricks ever to be aired on television, Magus Utopia, led by illusionist Marcel, managed to bring a waking nightmare to life. The trick starts off with Marcel going to bed and setting an alarm. Suddenly, he goes under his covers and is instantly changed into a woman. The act continues to get more and more bizarre as nightmarish creatures appear and throw Marcel in a cage. They wrap the cage up with black plastic and then stab and burn it, with the captive still inside. It all ends when the sleeping Marcel returns to reality with his alarm clock going off. It's safe to say that everybody watching was mesmerized and freaked out in equal measure. Megas Utopia did get a bit of backlash for the hypnotic performance after fans revealed that they had performed on the next great magician two years earlier, using the very same act and props as before. Number 2. Matt Franco in 2014, Matt Franco won Season 8 of America's Got Talent, claiming the $1 million prize. Three years later, the magician returned as a guest to perform one last trick to the judges while keeping them refreshed for the rest of the show. Matt manages to pour a glass of milk, beer, red wine, orange juice, water, and lemonade all from the same milk carton. What makes the trick more impressive is that the drinks are real and came from a carton that had no hidden compartments, something Matt was keen to show as he ripped the cardboard into pieces. Matt went on to have the first spin-off TV special for an America's Got Talent contestant, and is currently headlining at the Link Hotel and Casino in Las Vegas. In fact, his show is ranked the best magic show in all of Vegas, according to the reviews on Vegas.com. Number 1. Colin Cloud our final entry in this list has to be the mentalist, Colin Cloud. He showed the audience his bizarre skill of reading minds after licking Mel B's hand and whispering her darkest secret into her ear. This secret will never go any further, okay? The thing you're thinking is... Afterwards, he passed his gift on to Howie Mandel so he could successfully unlock the magician's phone. Whatever feels right, press. The trick was performed in Season 12 of America's Got Talent in 2017, which allowed Colin to reach the semifinals. The Scottish-born entertainer who used to go by the name Colin McLeod first tried his hand at Britain's Got Talent five years before his American counterpart debut. 
So that concludes our list of 10 magicians who managed to baffle and entertain on TV talent shows. Are there any performers you think should have made this list? Or were there any tricks you saw straight through? Let us know in the comments section below.